welcome back to another video today we are at sandwell valley uh, i've already made my first mistake of the day coming in the van there's actually a head restriction on the car park that's next to the uh, bike park so i've got about a 20 minute pedal now from the main visitor center over to the bike park we'll have a look at some trails when we get there see you in a bit nice little green trail they've put in from the visitor center i'm hoping it takes me to the bike park this is the car park we should have been in this is the one that's got the height restriction and that little green trail has brought us right here not a mass amount of trails two blues two reds and a black right in this is the blue run i don't think they've got names yet like i say it's only just it's only just been finished late autumn i have road here but only on night rides so i do quite kind of know what's coming i just wanted to get a get a sight in the daylight That's the first lap of the blue. So the blue starts at the top, same place, but then you have a split just after these two tables. Little manual on that one, and then we're going to go left here. It's a bit of a pedal to try and keep some speed. This is more berms, I think the other one's tables, this is more turns and berms. And then a double if you can get it. And another one. Yeah. And that's it. That's the two blues done. Nice little warm-up. There's some impressive stuff here. Just give you a quick show. I mean this is the bottom of the red. Big step up that is, that's the landing. You come across, the far track is the black. Now this is the bottom, it's a bit more chilled down here. The top section, I don't know if you can make it out through the trees. There's a big, big right hand hip over there. But uh, it kind of reminds me a lot like Northampton. So I'm, I've heard that they're all the same builders, but I'm going to say I, I think it is as well. And then for a free bike park again, Northampton's free, Leamington's free. This one now, Sandwell, this is free. All you got to do is pay for your parking. I've paid £1.20 for three hours here it's the blue just finished on the blue two tables at the bottom and the track behind it is the turns and the berms so just walking up the hill it's just a playground a free playground let's move on to the reds I'm sure it's got windy ash just as we're about to start the reds and there's definitely a step up in in trial ability between these two oh i've had too long <laughs> in the drain I can't get out. <clears throat> right, I think we'll try that again. Concentrate on what I'm doing instead of talking. That's better. Oh. I'm in a mare here. Let's try again. Right, into two little step downs, left and right. Yeah. Yeah. And then into the step to finish. Yeah, boy. And that's the red, eventually. Both red trails. Use the top section. Push that a bit further this time, and the step down. Watch the wind. Yeah, two step downs, but this time we're going to keep right. Yeah, whoa, nice and high on that one. 
and then jumping from one side to the other I don't know what that's called it's not a transfer is it because that's when you go from one track to another yep. here we go then sighting lap on the black let's have a look oh that's a big one Pump this. That's intimidating. Ooh. Oh my god, what are we gonna do on here? That did not feel nice. I think we might need a couple of practices on that. I'm riding on my own today. So I got nobody to nobody to follow to give you an idea. I got nobody to film. So unfortunately I've only actually got the POV and I know, I know myself it doesn't do it justice on the videos. But this line, this black line is huge compared to the red. Look at this hip on the side. I've had to put the bike there just to give you an idea of just how big it is. So there's that and there's this huge right hand hip, shark fin, I don't know, whatever, whatever they call them. You're up and out of that as high as you possibly can to carry the speed, make the jump that little bit longer and then the big finish jump at the bottom two options, one's a table, one's a gap another sighting lap on the back pump this one, keep speed oh, that's better, a little bit further, still wasn't great and I bottled this one, bottled it already, I knew I was doing that Ah. problem with POV, I know myself, it doesn't always show exactly what it is yeah boy got that one clean and that one commit to the jump yeah boy needed that then I need to get that bit of confidence back then and that's the black admittedly that can be ridden a lot better but I am right on my limit now my nerves are a little bit shaky so I think I'm going to call it at that I'm on my own I don't want to end up hurting myself and nobody here to help me I think I'm going to start and head back to the van and see what else we can find there is actually a dedicated trail as well which is just up here so it's called the Miners Trail it's graded as blue with some red and black sections another one over there red on the left, blue on the right to start but, uh, I've got to be honest I tell you now there's no black sections here there's no red sections uh, not in my view anyway but um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you the black section which is the finished jump and uh, I'll let you make your minds up on that one red, blue on the left, I'm going to start on the red keep the pedalling going it's still flat and then we're going to go into the black plenty of rollers, little table another table and then into the finish jump and that's the black section the trail, the whole trail is uh, about 15 minutes long so it is uh, short and sweet um, to me, I've just rode the bike park, so that was that trail was very, very tame. But uh, if you want to bring the families, and then it's definitely worth doing. Have an hour on this, a couple of hours on the bike park. You've got the pump track, you've got the um, sky trail. There's loads to do. It's definitely a day out. Bring a picnic. So if you if you like me and you struggle to get out without taking the families, then then this is definitely a good place to go. But uh, yeah, that's Sandwell Valley done for me today and I will catch you on the next one.